But we better get going. I'm sorry for barging in. No, don't worry about it. You ready to go? Yeah. You're holding things up here. I'll tell you what. Why don't you and Rick go to City Hall and I'll meet you there? Fine. Let's go. Don't be late. I don't want this dragging out all day. This is my wedding. And I'm going to make it special. Exactly why. Family pride, your family pride has cost us a lot of pain. Oh, well, I don't... No, I don't... I don't insist on Christopher. It happens to be my favorite name. But I'll settle for another. I'd kind of like to have my son named after me. Not now. May a proud grandfather come in. <laughs> <laughs> well, well, my little girl is a mother. <laughs> Um, um, am I interrupting something? No, no, actually, I was just about to go down to the coffee shop and uh, make some phone calls. I've got to tell the world about my son. Oh, I know what you mean. Quentin had to prevent me from taking out a full-page ad in the newspaper. Oh, <laughs> a full-page ad? Gee, Henry, that is a great idea. Really? <laughs> no, I'm, I'm just teasing, darling. I won't be long. I'll be right back. See you later, Billy. Bye. Well, my dear one. How are you feeling? Fine. Are you sure? Yes. Well, that's one handsome young man you produced there. <laughs> <laughs> well, maybe not exactly handsome. He's really sort of wrinkled when he looks... Oh. Oh, 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 I think he's beautiful. <laughs> <laughs> Daddy, tell me something. Hmm. After I was born, how did you and Mother decide on my name? Oh, well, we've been discussing that for months before you were born. And we both agreed on Vanessa. <laughs> and when Nola had A.J., the name was her decision. Quentin didn't have anything to do with it, did he? Oh, well, that was his choice. He knew how important it was to Nola. What was important to Quentin was that he had a son and he had a family he loved. Oh, darling, don't tell me there's some trouble about the name. Oh, yes, there is, Daddy. The name means a lot to me. But I want Billy to be happy. I don't know. I guess all that really matters is that the baby's healthy and happy. Work it out with Billy. Just take a deep breath and relax, Serena. Relax. I don't think you should be here. I'm not leaving. 
I've asked you to leave. Now, my mother is not feeling well. Please leave. Will you two, please be quiet. You're upsetting your mother. Are you feeling any better? Better. Good. Much better. Good. You'll still need to rest and to see your own doctor as soon as possible. Will you do that? Yes. I will. Thank you. Good. She's very weak and emotionally overwrought. I suggest that she was to rest. And she Are you planning to print off. any of this? To tell the story. But you can't print it. We don't know what any of the ramifications will be. Publishing this story now would only make everything worse for all of us. Hasn't this already caused enough pain for enough people? Can't you let it rest? All right, I'll tell you what I will do. I don't have all the facts right now, that's for sure, but... I'll at least promise you that I won't print anything without telling you first. Fair enough? All right. I'd appreciate that very much. Thank okay. you. Mm -hmm. How's Sharina? She's better. Will she be all right? I think so, yeah. I think it's time to go. Yeah. Right. And Baroness, I'll talk to you very soon. Thank you. Oh. Bye. Bye. My mother needs her rest. Will you please both leave? Of course. Father, I want to talk to you. Pretty heavy scene up there. You can talk to the business today. Writing the story. Mm -hmm. Hey, guys, how's it going? You okay? Hmm? Hi. Fine. Yeah, we're checking out of here. We're going back to Springfield. Right? Yep. Can we make reservations for you or anything? Okay, we'll see you later. Yeah. Bye. See you around. Well, it looks like there's just uh, one question that's left unanswered. Who are you going back to Springfield with? Jim or me? If you make hot cocoa for your kids, you've probably used... This portion of Guiding Light is presented by Mountain Grown Folgers. Folgers is the best part of waking up. And by Duncan Hines. You, Duncan Hines Deluxe. Hey, just let me say this, okay? A lot's happened in the last few months. <laughs> An awful lot. I mean, we've both said a lot of things that we shouldn't have. And I don't know what went on down here between you two. And I don't want to know. What I do know is we have a marriage. And I think we can go on. I think we should go on. And we will go on. If you want us to. My plane leaves in a couple hours. I hope my wife will be on it with me. I love you. be ready for you in a moment. Thank, Thank you, Yvonne. What an incredible day. Yeah. Secret. Yeah, they always have a way of catching up with you. I can't imagine what it's like for the Tamerlane. And the Baroness. Oh. Tony and Annabelle, too. And Jim. Yeah, it's been pretty rough for him. <laughs> 